children today we will learn how to calculate number of days between one date to another children we include the starting date but exclude the finishing date means hum starting date ko to count karte hain but finishing date ko count nahi karte and if the date includes the last week of the february last week of february include hai to hum dekhenge whether the year is a leap year or not agar leap year hai to we will count 29 days otherwise we will count 28 days now let's start exercise 8.1 and the question is solve these word problems the first one is the christmas vacation of a school started on 25th december the school reopened the following year on 10th january find the number of vacation days kitne din chutti thi that you have to find out first of all we will find out how many holidays are there in december और हॉलिडे स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम 25 दिसंबर यानी 25 दिसंबर को हॉलिडे थी दैट्स व्हाई द नंबर ऑफ डेज इन दिसंबर आर 31 31 माइनस ट्वेंटी सो व्हेन वी सेपरेट वी गेट सेवन डेज तो सेवन डेज इन दिसंबर वी हैव इंक्लूडेड 25th एंड 31st बोथ 25th और 31st दोनों को काउंट किया दैट्स व्हाई वी गॉट सेवन डेज राइट इन जनवरी स्कूल रीओपन ऑन टेंथ जनवरी मीन्स अप टू नाइन्थ इट वॉज हॉलीडे सो नाइन डेज इन जनवरी सो वेन वी एड सेवन एंड नाइन वी गेट सिक्सटीन डेज सो इन आर स्कूल द क्रिसमस वोकेशन इज फॉर सिक्सटीन डेज सेकेंड इज रोहन वॉज इन पेरिस फ्रॉम फोर सेप्टेंबर टू फिफ्टीन डिसम्बर द सेम इयर फॉर हाउ मेनी डेज वॉज ही इन पेरिस चिल्ड्रेन आपको काउंट करने डेज फ्रॉम फोर सेप्टेंबर टू फिफ्टीन डिसम्बर Children, since he was in Paris on fourth, so we'll include fourth and thirtieth both. And we know that number of days in September are thirty. So thirty minus three is twenty-seven days. October full month thirty-one days. November full month thirty days. And in December we will count fifteen days because he was in Paris on fifteenth December also. So one to fifteen is fifteen days. So total number of days are twenty-seven plus thirty-one plus thirty plus fifteen. When we add all these, we get one zero three days. So Rohan was in Paris for one zero three days. Now question three: A part is how many days after Christmas is our Republic Day? Christmas falls on twenty-fifth of December. Republic Day is on twenty-sixth of January. We will find the number of days from Christmas to Republic Day. See number of days in December are thirty one. After Christmas, we will exclude twenty fifth, so we will not count twenty fifth. So the number of days in December are thirty one minus twenty five, that is six days. And in January, one to twenty six, that comes to twenty six days. Therefore, total number of days comes six plus twenty six equal to thirty two days. So the answer is Republic Day is thirty-two days after Christmas. Now, third question B part: How many days before Christmas is our Independence Day? So number of days in December one to twenty-four equal to twenty-four days. Twenty-fifth we have excluded because we have to count before Christmas, right? So twenty-four days in December, November full month thirty days, October full month thirty-one days. September full month thirty days. In August we will count fifteenth and thirty first both. So we'll subtract fourteen days from thirty one days. So thirty one minus fourteen that comes to seventeen days. Now let's see how many total number of days. Twenty four days, thirty days, thirty one days, thirty days, and seventeen days. When we add all these, we get one thirty two days. Therefore, Independence Day is one thirty two days before Christmas. Fourth is how many days are there between Pongal 14th January and Baisakhi 13th April in a leap year? Children, whenever you have to find out the days between, you will exclude both days. 14th we exclude करेंगे, 13th को भी exclude करेंगे. So let's see. So January has 31 days. We will exclude 14th. So 31 minus 14 that comes to 17 days. February is a leap year. We will count 29 days. March 31 days. In April one to twelve because thirteenth we will exclude. So number of days in April are twelve. 
Now find out total number of days. 17 days plus 29 days plus 31 days plus 12 days. That comes to 89 days. Therefore, there are 89 days between Pongal and Besakhi. Fifth is at Priya school, the dance classes will be held from 11th May to 14th July. Both days included. For how many days will the classes be held? Children, you find out karna hai number of days. 11th May ko bhi count karenge and 14th July ko bhi count karenge. In May month, there are 31 days. 31 days minus 10 days. Because we are including 11th, so we will subtract 10 days from 31 that comes to 21 days. June full month, 30 days. And July 1 to 14, 14 days because we are including 14th also. So the total number of days are 21 plus 30 plus 14 that comes to 65 days. Therefore, previous dance classes will be held for 65 days. Sixth is Anuj joined swimming classes on 15th May for 45 days. What is the date of the last class? Children, you last class ka date find out karna hai. Let's see. Children, in May month, there are 31 days. You will subtract 14 because the first class was on 15th May. So, we will subtract 14 days. 31 minus 14, that comes to 17 days. And total days were 45. So, 45 minus 17, that comes to 28 days. So, 1 to 28 equal to 28 days. We are including 28 also. Therefore, the Anud last swimming class will be on 28th June. Seven days, Bharat left for the US on 21st December for 20 days. On what date was he supposed to leave the US? Days in December are 31. We will exclude 21st and include 31st. So, we will subtract 21 from 31. We get 10 days. So, total days are 20 days. And days left are 20 days minus 10 days equal to 10 days. So, in January, 1st to 10th equal to 10 days because 1st and 10th both are included. 10 and 10 milkar kya hoon 20 days. Therefore, Bharat was supposed to leave the US on 10th January. 8th is the students of class 5 had their sports on 5th February. If they started practicing 35 days earlier, on what date did the practice begin? So, days in February are 1 to 4 equal to 4 days because on 5th it was a sports day. So, 5th is excluded. So, days left. 35 days minus 4 days that comes to 31 days. In January there are 31 days and 1st and 31st both are included. So, total days are 31 in January. So, the practice for the sports day began on 1st January. Hope all the questions are clear to you now. To keep yourself safe during pandemic, it is important to wear mask, wash hands regularly, maintain social distancing. I hope you will follow all these points to remain safe and healthy. That's all for today. Bye-bye.